Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel. Sorry for the uh, noise in the background. It is a air conditioning running and it might be very present in the video audio. I'm trying to work on how I can adjust this. So uh, this is the new look. We're going to go quickly through the new Windows 11 build that insiders are getting. If you want to have really big details of the different things inside it, join my Windows Insider channel. I'll be talking about each feature and much more details there. Uh, the reason I'm not doing that here is because this is insider build, so it, it belongs in the insider ring or my insider channel. But when we get Windows 11 officially, of course, we're going to have all the details on the Windows channel here. But uh, for now, what's new? So, of course, everybody's familiar with, first of all, the start menu. And that is pretty much the same as it was. Uh, when we right click on the start menu, we have the menu uh, with all the little shortcuts for like device manager and stuff like that. What is uh, interesting in here, of course, is first of all, surprise, surprise, the settings app. Look at the new settings app right now, which is like this. Very different from what we had. Uh, each category and each section of you know system and whatever you want to choose as an option has its own list of uh, things here in this very new fashion which is totally different from what the uh, settings app had before so instead of having you know uh, icons and a big screen splash screen with all the options it's really everything's on the left side you click whatever you want to go and tweak in the settings and you have all that appear, appearing on the right side. This is very interesting. Uh, very, I was not, I was not expecting it to be like this right now. So this is definitely a very different way of actually uh, having the settings app right now. Uh, of course, there's the animations and everything. Um, something else. So of course, there's the widgets. Widgets have been tweaked a little more. You have widgets with pictures. You have widgets with different things that they've added here and the top stories and you can add widgets so when you click here add widgets it's going to tell you what you want to add and um, apparently eventually there are going to be some uh, third party widgets that might actually show up in here also something interesting and new when you click for example here the first surprise I had is I want to go and tweak my volume and I get both the volume and the Wi-Fi, which is kind of weird on the same panel, but when you click, it brings this new panel from the uh, right side of the screen with, of course, my volume control, but also, also other options. And this is kind of interesting uh, when you look at it. So um, kind of really interesting. Focus assist. You have, of course, all of this. This is a the new panel, the new way that the panel is uh, created with the notifications it can clear all and it actually goes away with the panel the panel with notifications is not even there anymore when you clear the, the notifications which is kind of interesting a new uh, calendar look and feel which is kind of nice so all of this is kind of cool some really really interesting stuff what hasn't changed yet uh, of course the security app which is supposed to have a new look also is for now pretty much what it looks like in our Windows 10 machine. And uh, the Android stuff is not there yet. The Microsoft Store, a little bit changed, but it's not what we should have eventually, apparently, uh, even though it is, it is different. Uh, but it might be even more different than this. Uh, and of course, there's going to be the uh, famous uh, Android apps that that that's going to be interesting to see with the Amazon Amazon store and stuff. So this was a quick look uh, at what we have right now. If we look at the uh, Windows version, of course, Winver will give us the uh, version of Windows 11, but it states, as you see, version 21H2 for build 22,000.51. So that's pretty much what it is look looking like right now. Uh, I might update this video with a general feel of all the Windows 11 uh, build uh, in the uh, future. But like I said, if you want to have very 
detailed videos of every feature, every new little thing in here. The Windows Insider channel is where you can actually look at my videos. And um, there you'll see all the stuff before everybody else. And of course, we'll be focusing on Windows 11 when it releases uh, later this year, around Christmas, uh, early uh, next year. Uh, hope you enjoyed this look at what's available right now. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up, and thank you for watching my videos on this channel.